Welcome to Iron Hand Tech. Today we are going on an exciting journey of recycling old cars, where old cars, which seem to be just waste, become valuable resources. Have you ever wondered where our old cars, once our pride, go when they no longer run? Let me explore this magical transformation process. Recycling is not just about processing scrap metal into new products, but also about the story of regeneration and protecting our planet. But first, why should we recycle old cars? What is so special about these cars that have served us for decades? First, let's talk about the environment. Not only do old cars take up a lot of space in landfills, they also contain a lot of toxic substances. If not disposed of properly, they can pollute the land and water. Recycling cars helps reduce this toxic waste. According to statistics, recycling steel from cars can save up to 74% of energy compared to producing new steel from raw materials. This not only reduces CO2 emissions, but also saves precious natural resources. And for comparison, recycling just or six cars is enough to build a brand new steel frame house. Second, the economics. An old car is more than just a pile of scrap metal. The average car is about 65% steel, 8% aluminum, 16% plastic, and many other materials, all of which can be reused. Recycling helps us recover these materials, reducing waste and creating new economic value. Recycling old cars also creates jobs for thousands of workers. According to the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency, EPA, the auto recycling industry contributes billions of dollars to the economy each year. Now let's take a look at the process of recycling an old car. Brace yourselves because we are about to embark on a journey that is no less exciting. First, workers will disassemble everything possible from the car. The dismantling process requires meticulousness and high technology. Valuable parts such as the engine, gearbox, and tires will be reused or resold. At the same time, hazardous waste will be treated according to regulations to avoid polluting the environment. Statistics show that about 80% of the parts of an old car can be reused or resold. Next, all fluids such as oil, fuel, coolant are drained and safely disposed of. It is estimated that an average car contains about 40, 50 liters of fluids, which if not disposed of properly can cause serious pollution. After dismantling, the car is pressed and fed into a crusher to be crushed into small pieces. Crane operators will lift a car and put it into the crusher. In just a few seconds, the car will be turned into a loaf of steel. The cars are then fed into the crushers via a conveyor system. These are hungry steel giants with their sharp, toothy mouths always wide open and their terrifying power of hundreds of tons of crushing force. Within minutes, the car goes from being intact to being reduced to metal scraps. Statistics show that every year, about 12, 15 million used cars are crushed in the US. These scraps are then sorted and transported on a conveyor system, which has two conveyor belts, each with two magnets, the purpose of which is to separate the steel from the remaining materials inside the car, such as plastic, copper, leather seats, electrical wires. About 75% of the weight of an old car can be recycled into new materials. The steel scraps are further carefully sorted to obtain the cleanest steel before entering the recycling stage. The sorted metal is fed into the melting furnace. The steel pieces are fed into the arc furnace, 
where the electrodes are equipped with a high power electric source that creates an arc that ionizes the surrounding gas particles to form plasma. The high temperature of the plasma melts the steel. The electrodes are constantly adjusted to maintain a stable arc and melt the entire block of steel. The molten steel is then refined and cast, poured into a specially shaped mold, and cooled slowly to form a steel billet. From here, the steel is processed into coil steel or other types of steel according to its intended use. This process helps us recover about 15 million tons of steel each year from old cars in the US. And so from old cars, we have new steel bars ready for a new life. Recycling steel from cars helps to significantly reduce greenhouse gas emissions compared to producing new steel contributing to environmental protection and creating significant economic values. Recycling cars is not only an industrial process, but also an act of environmental and resource protection. Every old car, no matter how many years it has served us, still has value and potential for a new life. Thank you for following our car recycling journey today. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on future exciting videos. And remember, every old car is not just a pile of scrap metal, but a treasure waiting to be discovered. See you in the next video.